welcome back it's another gorgeous day in london i can't believe it it's so hot it's too hot to even kind of walk miles because you need loads and loads of water and then there's just there's nowhere to pee in london there's i mean obviously there's parks and bushes but there's lots of people around it feels a bit weird um don't think you need to know about that affect my hydration techniques what you do need to know about is the fact that i'm about to do an alf the new classics eyeshadow um, I put this dressing gown on today for my friend Lauren because it's my summer dressing gown because it's really light and it's linen um, and I thought that it might inspire me to do kind of a, a peachy kind of a soft pinky peachy eye um, and actually when I was looking at this palette on the back they have the three stages of where to put the your eyeshadow so one would be the base two the crease and three the liner and then different eyeshadow combinations that would work and the top one is number one which is truffle which is here number two which is darling here and then muse sorry i'm lying truffle darling and muse truffle darling yeah that's right and muse which is here so it's these three along the middle and i thought i would actually go with their suggestion so all over the base of the eye i'm going to pop truffle so i'm just going to put that all over my lid a little bit darker than i would normally do on a lid color but you know let's go it go with it is what they have it told us to do so i'm just using a really soft rounded blending brush just to blend that all over my eye and pull that slightly up onto my brow bone so it goes all over my movable eye socket which is the bit that you blink with and then i'm going to go in with darling which is this slightly more taupe darker shade i'm going to work that into my crease i've dipped in once i haven't put it back in the eyeshadow i'm actually just using the amount that i picked up on my bristles to go back and forth into my eye socket which is the deep bit in your eye this bit that I can push into here you don't push too hard into your eye socket I mean you know your eyes are important um how else would you see me um th I'm gonna pop those in and just blend those back and forth and just work them again up into the brow bone these colors are fairly similar the the darling is definitely a lot deeper than the truffle Maybe I would have gone a little bit paler on my lid. I might bring in some paleness on my lid afterwards. And then the third one is Muse, and I'm going to need a little liner brush for that. That's not a liner brush. I don't know where they are. Hi guys, we're not going to use a liner brush because I can't find it. We're just going to get a bit of the muse on the very edge of my um very tip of my blending brush and i'm just going to put that into my outer corner and just softly blend that onto my lash line what would be nice if i could actually do a tutorial to one day for you with the products i actually need and the tools i need to do that with that'd be a treat for everybody wouldn't it just going to take that really gently into that outer corner up around it back into my socket a little bit and along my lash line so i'm sort of doing a kind of c shape there okay i think my eyes need a bit of a pop now so that's the three they recommended i'm actually going to go in with their mattes they're all really matte colors which i love but i need a bit of a pop especially on a sunny day i'm gonna pop in a bit of this beloved which is a slightly um i'm using the same brush again it's fine um slightly uh, shimmery pale sort of pearly pearly pink i'm gonna pop that onto my lash onto my eyelid i mean just to try and give that a little pop there that's better that's lifted it up a little bit it's a really pretty colors together just really inoffensive aren't they so let's go on with a little bit of my pericone md mascara and see what that looks like with a bit of mascara because i think i can never tell an eye or how much i need or how much more i need to put on until my lashes are done because lashes make the biggest difference to anything you're doing you could do nothing and put your eyelashes on and then suddenly you can walk out of the room feeling confident that's for me anyway i think eyelashes are so so important and brows anything else is just a bonus yeah i think that's enough for a sunny day so a little three stage elf eyeshadow tutorial, you're welcome. <laughs> 